Uh, let's look at uh, Matthew 20, 26 and verse 41. Matthew 26 and verse 41. Somebody say better choices. Better choice. Amen. Would anybody admit it's the choices that I've made that has gotten me in the mess that I'm in right now? Amen. The predicament that I'm right now in. And I made I made the wrong choice. Amen. How, how many of us know we can make the wrong choice? Amen. About who you should date, who you should marry, who you should get. Oh, y'all ain't saying that right now. Amen. 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 You, you can make the wrong choice. Amen. And after you make the choice now, you in it. You stuck. Yeah. You stuck. Amen. I'm advising everybody that's not married before you marry, seek God's counsel. Amen. You do not marry just because your flesh is telling you to do it. That, that could be the worst choice you could ever make. Amen. Amen. Y'all ain't saying that. See, the flesh will tell you, go ahead on and do it because the flesh just want to be gratified. The flesh just want to be gratified and it'll tell you to do the wrong thing. And now after your flesh has been gratified, now you got to live with them another 20 hours and, 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 oh and 59 God. seconds. Oh my God. Y'all figure that out. Oh yeah. <laughs> you figure that one out. <laughs> the 23 hours and 59 seconds. You got to live with them now. Amen. Now, in Matthew 26, talking about making better choices, first thing I got to do is ask God for help. See, our, our wisdom will cause us to shipwreck. Come on. Amen. Let's look at Matthew 26 and see what the word says. Matthew 26, 41. What does it say? Watch and pray that ye enter not into temptation. The spirit indeed is willing, but the flesh is weak. You see, if, if you're going to make better choices, you got to keep your eyes open. See, a lot of folk know that there's a problem before they make the choice. But for some reason, you trick yourself into believing that after I make the choice, the situation is going to change. And it doesn't change. It only gets worse. You're like, get a witness. It doesn't, it doesn't change. It changes for the worse. It doesn't get better. But he said, watch. As well as pray. You know, a lot of times in church, you close your eyes to pray. Amen. Sometimes you better have more.
going through. But if you're going to make better choices, watch as well as pray and ask God to give you strength when the enemy brings alcohol and drugs and whatever, pornography and drugs and whatever it is that, that has you, you know, when you can't seem to stay anchored in the word of God, you need to bind those spirits and ask God for strength. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. The devil wants you to just do the wrong thing so that you can abort your... Do y'all know everybody here is destined for greatness? Yes. Yes. Thank you, Lord. I'm not, well, I'm not, I felt something right there. I felt something right there. Thank See, you. some of you all don't feel that way. I'm not talking to y'all. I'm talking to the ones in here that know your current state, where you at right now, is not your final resting place. This is not God's best for my life. Some of us need to work on our attitudes. 
Not some of us. Yeah, yeah. If it's you, don't don't act like it ain't you. If you know it's you, then you know I can't get no help if I don't acknowledge that's me. That's me. I got to work on my attitude. You know, my patience is short. I, I got I'm, I, I got a short fuse. Come on, man.